Hey guys and welcome to your new video on this channel, I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So let me show you how, how I upload my latest plugin to Code Canyon. So in this process you will be able to see how exactly I upload plugins to Code Canyon and you will be able to learn and to do so after this example. So these are my plugins that I already uploaded on Code Canyon. I have 110 plugins so far and let me upload my 111th plugin so click upload here in the menu here we select wordpress not plugins because these are general plugins not wordpress plugins but select wordpress if you have wordpress plugins click next here in the name we should set the name of the item that we wish to upload and this description i already completed the description so for the description i have this template i can use so i copy this paste it here and the name of the item is rss transmute so this is the name of the item but let me elaborate this a bit more so rss transmute and align and let us say copy spin copy translate spin let me check exactly how i wrote copy translate spin merge get full content oh, okay so this is a bit long so we can leave this rss transmute copy translate spin merge rss feeds okay so this is the title this is the html content the title is, seems to be correct and here we can choose Files. so this is the folder from where I wish to import content and this is the avatar I created so the thumbnail uh, preview image should be this the resolution of the preview image you should keep in mind that it should be um, 590 times 300 so this is the resolution that Inveto accepts main files should be the uh, documentation together with the installable zip file of the plugin so I keep this in versions and this is the package this is the package which includes the plugin files with its documentation also the installable zip file of the plugin can also be uploaded and this should be selected here in the WordPress plugin dropdown. We can now upload screenshots for the plugin in a zip file. I have this ready here. So screenshots, if we check the screenshots folder, we have some screenshots I created for the plugin to show its basic functionality okay live preview this will be the live preview so this is the doc the live uh, preview uh, page of the site of the plugin this is also uploaded in a zip file if you check the live preview it's here and uh, it practically promotes the plugin with its demo okay an optional uh, preview video this should be also here and it should be this one so this is an optional video but i like uploading tutorial videos for my plugins because people are more likely to uh, be able to configure them after they check the video and they watch it carefully okay so the video uploading takes a bit longer but it should be ready in a minute if your video is too large you have to use um, filezilla or other uh, 
file uploading uh, programs to upload your file to their uh, web to their hosting space to Envato's hosting space because they have a maximum limit of uh, files over 300 megabytes are recommended to up be uploaded uh, with FTP so if your file is larger than this then it should be uploaded with FTP my file in this case let me check it is 259 so it's under the 300 megabyte limit and because of this this upload worked and we can select the video preview here so category is MISC Gutenberg optimized in this case my plugin is not working anything with Gutenberg I mean its functionality is not interfering with Gutenberg and in this case I can't say that it is optimized for Gutenberg because it has no functionality that ties itself to post editing or to Gutenberg and in this case is not applicable high resolution not applicable for this plugin compatible browsers uh, we can select everything compatible with let's select some um, more uh, technologies and uh, plugins here more popular this will allow the plugin to appear in more search results so if we select here popular uh, plugins and tech then people that will search for these plugins or tech might also find my plugin when they will make the search queries okay so let's select what the zip file contains it contains javascript css and ht and php okay so software version it works with wordpress until wordpress 4 and 5.4 demo url the demo url is uh, um, let me think about rss transmute this should be the correct demo url yes it is and we copy this and paste it here with https and the video preview resolution we click right click on the video work that we uploaded click details and we see 1920 so 1920 times 992 so 992 okay tags these are some tags that should be append to that should be appended to the plugin so we can uh, say here uh, RSS feed maximum 15 tags are allowed so RSS feed RSS customizer copy RSS edit RSS spin RSS translate rss rss editor rss translator rss spinner rss feed 2.0 how many do i have so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten five more so uh, um, RSS full content full content RSS feed get full content RSS uh, modify RSS affiliate RSS okay so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve fourteen fourteen fifteen yeah i double checked it i have 15 right now item is supported regular license let's put this plug into 
29 dollars for beginning and we will see what will happen afterwards extended license i put five times the price of the regular license so in this case it's 145 this is the price of the item this is the inveto uh, fee and this is the purchase price of the cost for customers Inveto will take also 12.25% uh, of this price additionally to this $5 fixed fee and yeah here are some comments to leave to the reviewer hello have a nice day thank you for your kind review and check this to show that everything that you upload belongs to you or you have the rights to upload them and to sell them and a quick double check and we can go ahead and upload the item so a quick side note is that Enveto used to have a review time for uploaded items of five, six, seven days and we can see that it's successfully uploaded and it is wait, waiting for review process. So I'm talking about this review process that they usually had a five, six, seven day wait time for review of newly submitted Enveto plugins or WordPress plugins, but now they have a five, six hour wait time. So this is greatly reduced and I am really happy of this. So thank you for watching. This is all. I will link in this video's description the plugin when it will be approved and yeah this is all for this time have a nice day stay safe bye bye